Hello everyone, I'm Sue Mae Thompson, CEO of the Women's Foundation. 2015 was a very busy and exciting year for TWF. We expanded the breadth and depth of our community and professional programs. We released several best practice guides and we ramped up our public engagement around the core themes of positive education and resilience training for Hong Kong youth, tackling gender stereotypes in the media and encouraging women and girls to embrace technology. We are particularly proud of our undergraduate big brothers and sisters in this year's teen programme. Several of them were teen participants themselves six years ago, and they have now come full circle and are paying it forward by mentoring our current cohort of teens. In addition, we were able to accomplish a long-time goal for TWF with the making of She Objects, our new documentary that was completed in early 2016. The film could not have been made without the encouragement and funding support of many people and our partner organisations, and it's been hugely validating to see the positive response from international film festivals to local Hong Kong audiences. Drawing on the film, which has the endorsement of the Education Bureau, we hope to roll out workshops to promote media literacy and critical thinking on the part of secondary and university students across Hong Kong. Another exciting new initiative which we launched in 2015 was the pilot of our Girls Go Tech programme, a free after-school initiative that provides secondary school girls from underprivileged backgrounds with coding and digital literacy skills to maximise their future career opportunities. The programme was selected by Operation Santa Claus at the end of 2015 for OSC funding, which will allow us to expand the reach of the programme into more schools in 2016. Embracing the spirit of he for she, we have also redoubled our efforts to engage men in championing for gender equality both at home and in the workplace through the launch of the TWF Male Allies a cohort of influential male leaders from around 30 organisations who have committed to both influencing institutional changes at their own organisations and personal actions to advance gender equality in Hong Kong. We still have a long way to go, but I am confident that we are moving in the right direction. And thanks to our ever-growing list of far-sighted supporting corporations, foundations, government agencies and media organisations, we continue to shoot for ambitious goals and systemic societal change beyond what we can achieve alone. Thank you to all of our incredible supporters and donors and the many individuals and institutions with whom we are working to achieve a brighter and more equitable Hong Kong for all.